This is the Jilly Bowl medley. Get it at otfi.com slash Jilly Bowl. It runs for two minutes and 12 seconds. The, the thing about bee pollen <laughs> is I, I remember using it to masturbate while I was listening to my favorite Billy Joel novelty song. <laughs> <laughs> She'll get on her knees. <laughs> You'll cry as you jerk off. She's always a pony to me. <laughs> Put tits on that horse! <laughs> oh, God damn, let's start this thing! It's Tuesday night and the internet's on fire. It's time for Night Attack. Hello, you beautiful people. I'm Brian Brush with Live in Austin, Texas. Joined, as always, by my inimitable co-host, J-R-Y in O-A-K. What is up, Justin Robert Ru- Young? Rung, rung? <clears throat> Take two. Oh, man. We're going to climb the rungs of comedy tonight uh, on the program, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Brian, I'm doing fantastic. Can I just... One more round of applause for Cogswell the God. My yeah. God. Amazing. My God. I was unprepared for that. Like, I was like, those guys are funny, and, they, and they're, they're musically talented. And then I realized neither of those things are true. <laughs> and that somehow he's able to create that illusion. Uh, just, uh, just, just amazing, amazing work. Everybody go to Autfy, A-W-T-F-Y dot com. Uh, oh, jeez. So good. So good. <laughs> hey, man, we're joined live in studio by Mike TV of Get Set Go. Mike, uh, good to see you, man. Hey, thank you for, thanks for having me here, guys. I'm excited. Yeah. Uh, so as a musician, yes. how great are we for being funny? Uh, in yeah. yeah, you know, I mean, I mean, really, really. Sharp interviewer <laughs> skills coming out at the gate. I mean, I mean, me and Charlie Rose were the best. I mean, you guys did give him a lot of material to work with, right? You know, the thing is, I mean, certainly he, he blended together, made it. I mean, I, he, what he does is magic it's sheer magic i'm i'm figuring that there's probably like the blood of innocent children are spilled or something because it's it's that it's like that amazing <laughs> it's that, it's that yeah, yeah 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 but uh but um but yeah man uh you know but you guys definitely did uh, had, uh, there was a lot of there was a lot of songs that night that was pretty a lot, a lot pretty of, epic yeah, a lot of jerking off a lot stuff. of songs a lot of hey, songs uh justin were you yeah. jerking off during your mri was I jacking it during my MRI? Yeah. No, I, I, I was not. I slept during my MRI. Uh, uh, although, I mean, I guess I could have jacked it just kind of like out of habit. Like, I got to sleep jacked it. <laughs> they, they ask you, like, everybody's awkward when you come out of the MRI. And they're like, sir, were you? Uh, and they were like, oh. Yeah. Was I sleep jacking again? <laughs> that's a, yeah. that's a no, thing. Yeah. Should have warned I, you guys. That's, that's the new thing to do. If anyone ever catches you jacking off. Just make them wake you up. (laughs) 
Even yeah, if you're, you're just, standing you're up, sitting. even if you're standing up, and then they'll be like, like, like oh, oh, geez, oh my God, I must have fallen asleep uh, uh, standing yeah. up, and then I, little, was I sleepjacking? You let a little snore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, he must be sleepjacking again. You know, yeah, uh, no, never mind him. That's a that's a uh, a Matt King bit that showed up in one of Penn and Teller's books. Is like he'll prep the person next to him on a flight. So like, hey, just so you know, I'm probably gonna doze off on this flight, and they're like, oh yeah, of course, of course. They're like, well. I got this thing where I, when I do fall asleep, my eyes will still be open. So it may be a little bit weird. Just, yeah, just have way And then, yeah. uh, and then he goes on to wait until halfway through the flight when he just hangs his head down and stares directly at them <laughs> with just like these insane eyes as he starts snoring, staring at them. <laughs> oh my God. That's fucking amazing. <laughs> That's amazing. Uh, hey, uh, well, so how, how was the experience? Was it as loud as they told you? I mean, I guess you slept through it. Oh God, yeah, no, uh, uh, it was it was loud. I don't know. I guess it's really more for people that that have claustrophobia. Uh, uh, and I guess we had a newer machine, so it was like open on both ends, so it wasn't like I was in some like torpedo tube or anything. I don't know. It was kind of a uh, kind of uh, uh, overblown. In my opinion, it was it was it was all right. It was all right. But, but got, got the MRI and found out that uh, uh, I have a pinched nerve in my back, which uh, is why a bulging disc apparently, a bulging dicks. Um, <laughs> and uh, and so now it, it's it's a uh, we're going through some stuff. I'm gonna get a cortisone shot and go to physical therapy and meh, meh, meh. so yep. it still sucks now, but. but but you got a roadmap, right? It's like, uh, yeah, yeah. You got a diagnosis, and it came back not hypochondria. That's all that matters, right? Yeah, it came back. Yeah, that I'm not some lunatic who's creating his own uh, uh, bizarre, pain-filled reality. I, I indeed do have a physical malady, and we are going to take efforts to correct it. Uh, one thing that is uh, a real bummer, though, is that I had to make the decision today. I'm not going to be going to Gen Con this weekend, uh, uh, or going to see the eclipse, uh, just because I want to keep off the back and uh oh. I, I traveling would be a problem so if you were planning on seeing me at gen con uh john is still going to be uh demoing the contender in action news at the escape room in indianapolis to go to escape room indie.com if you want to see where that is but uh unfortunately uh it sucked a lot but i had to uh i had to i had to just kind of make the decision to Keep it, keep it healing Are, instead of uh, instead of stretching it through the road. I mean, I guess the good news is that we're about to enter a few years of there being more eclipse opportunities. I know, I know, oh, really? it comes right over Austin in like four or five years. I, oh, I, I want to say twenty twenty four or something awesome. like that. Um, uh, oh, I yeah. mean, yeah, I, I there's nothing that I wanted to do more than. I mean, we've been talking about this eclipse thing for for months now, but I, I really felt it was like if I wasn't going to Gen Con. Like I can't, I can't go play with my friends after school if I stayed home sick. And so it's like, if I can't go to Gen Con, then it's it's still like a, a bad idea for me to get on a plane and fuck around going to Portland and sure. sit in the bar for a while. So uh, 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 hopefully it won't break your heart if if I talk about our plans for uh, the eclipse. Oh no 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 no! Please 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 do go ahead. Because well, because, uh, well uh, uh, first, uh, first of all, I realize this is the closest I'll ever get in my lifetime outside of an actual zombie apocalypse to simulate a zombie apocalypse. Because like uh, the stuff I'm hearing is just insane. Like everyone's like, "Where are you gonna go?" I'm like, "Don't know. Wherever the sky is clear, that, yeah. that that's where mm -hmm. I'm gonna go." Right? And it's like, "I want to book a flight," and it was like, "Because flights get delayed, and I'm not gonna miss this." And yeah. so instead, like we rented this RV that we're going to have to deck out uh, like a battle wagon with provisions for, 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 for the five of us. And there's a good chance that we won't be able to take the main roads because the whole fucking country is, heading, is going yeah. to go uh, to the same place at the same time. In fact, I, I think I talked about this last week. I was told that the interstate in Wyoming, they're going to shut down all four lanes and make them all northbound leading up to the eclipse and then southbound immediately afterwards. Right. Um, and on top of that, they're saying that the cellular providers will, will not be uh, in the rural areas. They're not going to be prepared for the influx. So that means, that means I gotta, I gotta get printed out maps. I gotta, I gotta bust out a compass and yeah. teach my kids <laughs> how to, how to, how to find this stuff. Um, and, uh, but I was looking through the line of the ecliptic and the place that I think that I think I've decided on a target and maybe it'll be cloudy. Maybe we'll end up somewhere else, but yeah. Yeah, where? Do Dollywood. You? Okay, are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> All right. Uh, 
the uh, uh, right dead center in the middle of it is a city that was one of the first big road gigs I did as a student or, or, or as, as getting started in, in doing the, the live stage shows. And it's where the guy who's in charge of student activities, his son is one of our biggest supporters on weird things. The guy I oh, met oh my God. in Indonesia, Paul Freeland, comes from yes. his dad uh, is still living, as far as I know. I haven't written him because instead I just talk on the internet. Um, uh, Grand Island, Nebraska is exactly 12 and a half hours straight oh north my God. of Austin. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Is this where, well, we never released this track, right? This is the origin of Scam School. That, that's right. That's uh, exactly, exactly. Wait, okay, wait, all right. Sorry, uh, no, wait, wait, the you... day, uh, in fact, it was, it was on Night Attack 3, the day the real Brian Brushwood was born. This is, we could go to that Holiday Inn and yes. experience the eclipse <laughs> there. It's, uh, oh, uh, God. Yeah, Look, that, back. I'm flying out to Grand Island, Nebraska. <laughs> <laughs> Why didn't you tell me this shit? It's on. <laughs> we're going. We're gonna tear that fucker up. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited. Pretty and we're excited. We're all gonna ask each other how much we're worth. Call back. Buy uh, the album. Uh, oh shit, that's right. That was a weird moment. <laughs> Uh, dude. Yeah. Uh, anyway, so I'm excited. Uh, it's going to be like two days going up, two days going back, which means I think we'll have to do not attack at a different time or we'll see how my internet capabilities are. During yeah. I'm not, stuff. I'm not, uh, it's hot that we're going to do it on time next yeah. week. Yeah. We'll yeah, find that's, out. That, I don't know. I mean, do they have, yeah, they must have some sort of semblance of internet there. Yes. <sighs> well, I mean, it, like, I, mean I, I could record it to a wax cylinder. Oh, and yeah. Have a yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's not, yeah. I mean, that would make yeah, sense. No, no, that's, actually, just get the, the Pony hot, Express. That's, that's a lot of the, the, the hot podcasts are coming out on wax cylinders these days. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's just like all the true crime stories, you know, just on wax cylinders. People are loving them, spinning those rolls. You know, Don't you know. It's it's it is actually entirely possible to record a a podcast on a wax cylinder like that. that someone has to, at some point in time. Somebody, some yeah, some you do. Right, right, so yeah. Wax cylinders. Let's let's look this up. How do we get a wax cylinder up in this bitch? Yeah, no, because oh. you, you can go to, you can go to the Edison Labs and actually just get a. They they still record wax cylinders. That's they might be giants recorded that one song that sounds like it's on a wax cylinder. They Was record it wax that cylinders on a wax song? cylinder. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. It's a. Uh, Oh my uh, God! So you can wait. This is so a real kit. Yes, yeah, so it's entirely uh, possible. It's entirely. I think this is just a phonograph. I think this is a just podcast. Playback. Okay, on there's a cylinder. British. There's a British company that makes wax cylinders. So Ooh. listen, I know we've Night had we have wax. some ideas <laughs> about the new album, uh, and we still got to do a little bit of work to finish it. Uh, but no matter what, we need to put the album on a wax cylinder Hell and yeah. have a giveaway. <laughs> yep. Yep, uh, yep, yep. Or, I don't, yeah, I don't, or, I don't. I don't. If you could see the consternation on Bryce's face right now, I don't. I don't think that they. I don't think they've got a lot of. All out. Bryce is hearing is more work. Well, I just not. <laughs> I don't. I don't think they've I'd got. Say ten for I don't think they've got a lot of capacity. So I, I, I think that like the like the amount of time you can put on one is is pretty limited. But you could definitely do a portion. But I mean, we could do. We, a, we can make yeah. it like time relevant. We're like yeah. jerking off to Brillo Cream. The song. The yeah. song. The song. It's the, cat's the, pajamas. The, oh, it's a dream. We're the, jerking off with the hair product. The they might be giant song was. It's on. Uh, it's on Factory Showroom, and it's it's the one where. Uh, it, where they're where, they, where he, they're like ordering at, at the drive thru It's 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 all things that you hear. It's anyway, but I I forget the name of it. But uh, Dapper anyway, Dan, but but he's but, my it, man. but I think I think that's the, about the capacity. So it's like a couple minutes. You know, it's it's like they yeah. even get on the cylinders. Yeah, but it's okay. so we'll do all some right. cold six opens. Week, six week lead time. It would be two hundred and twenty pounds. Uh, to get a wax cylinder each. Uh, no, no, no. Two wax cylinders we get for two hundred and twenty. Oh boy, <laughs> uh, that's how an idea. Yeah, I mean, I mean, how committed to giving somebody something that they'll never be able to use, could <laughs> not ever <laughs> once listen to. No, yeah, yeah, but, but they'll, they'll put it in at time. that price. We might as well just buy any wax cylinder. But I, I, hold on, I, I actually kind of like this. What if we did an album where each yeah. track was from a different century? Right? There's one on a wax cylinder, oh, and it's yeah. the two of us talking. Oh. Oh, yeah. and, and we're doing it of the style and eventually it goes back to like a papyrus
papyrus of us doing yeah. eight equals 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 yeah. D or some shit. Yeah. Like like some uh, version. Hello, Brian. It's me, uh, 1910's Night Attack. Uh, <laughs> I'm uh, just trying to uh, wonder what those mongrel Italians are up to. <laughs> And the end of the bit because there's too many off ramps I don't like. <laughs> uh, so, uh, in many ways, this whole eclipse trip is going to be like a um, uh, time travel back to 2003, where it's like the phones will be good for basically phoning, and that's it. Like I'm gonna have to take I mean, sorry. Right, yeah, yeah. You, it, the, you, you don't think that there's a little Y2K to that? Like I'm glad that you're pre I'm glad that you're prepping because there's a good chance that it could happen. But it seems a little Y2K of like, I, uh, all right, everybody. I don't think you guys nope. realize oh, and how much we're only gonna communicate in axe throwing. Well, I, I, is... I don't think you realize how much I enjoyed preparing for Y2K. And like there's <laughs> <laughs> there's definitely no, I, have, I, I still have the kits. I still have, yeah, like, like, there's definitely a photo of me in my underwear holding a shotgun that was recorded at midnight nineteen ninety nine. It was amazing. Uh, uh, so when when are you leaving then? What when are when are you off uh, with with the fam? Because I was there during an initial planning meeting where you put uh, your oldest Penny in charge of some of the the roadside attractions, which she did not seem to understand what a roadside attraction I know you guys was, that? everything was either Disney World or a zoo. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and you're like, well, here's this uh, university where we could go. And I was like, sweetheart, we're, we're, we're going to have five minutes. Uh, that'll be it. Uh, yeah, no, uh, we're, we're going to head out um, two days before. I guess it's what, on Monday? So we'll head out on Saturday and then come back on Wednesday or whatever. Nice. Yeah. Uh, and uh, it, well, and, and the, the whole thing with maps is like, is like, because I'm certain if I'm certain if people are traveling there, if if everybody's heading that way, yeah, there's gonna be at some point in time where you're gonna be like, we need to get off this freeway and find an alternate route, but you don't have your but the phones, phone won't be working. So you're gonna have that's so you're gonna I'm have saying. to break out the, like the Thomas guides See, this guy and start and it. that's and that's and that's awesome because that's like I mean it's literally like being on tour back in 2002 2003 and you're like all right guys we need to get here we can't this the freeway's been shut down for whatever reason sure let's sort it out and you end up on these. These roads that like, what well, it's, it's that, like. Uh, this is what I had to explain to Penny is like you know she got really frustrated because uh, she felt like I was refusing to plan appropriately. She was like, well, we should have a plan. We should know where we're going. And I'm like, wait, wait no, uh, we shouldn't have a plan. We should have five plans yeah. and decide last minute which one is the most effective. Yeah. And she's like, no, no. And I'm like, and I, and I had to explain. I'm like, Penelope. Spent 20 years of my life. I'm pretty much a world class expert at showing up at certain places in the United a States time. at yeah. exact times. <laughs> like, it was pretty much my full-time gig for 20 years. I'm going to know a little bit about this. Yeah. But she, she was not having that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, you know, she's So wise. I fired her. Fired yeah. her. Yeah. She's no longer my daughter. Yeah. She's acting like a teenager. <laughs> yeah. <or> what? <laughs> I'm professional. <laughs> yeah, dude. That's a... Uh, uh... That's that's gonna be a fun trip, man. I, I am I am I am definitely jealous that you are you're you're hitting the road. Just even like a road trip should be fun. Also, that's probably this is probably the most fun it will be it before you actually realize that you're going on the road with three children. Yeah. <laughs> Flavor Toothpaste says uh that on Y2K his dad shut off the power to the whole house and went into a big I told you so. <laughs> <laughs> he manufactured the disaster. <laughs> Y2K was an inside job. That's amazing. <laughs> uh yeah, so I'm I'm super excited about that. That that'll be a fun trip. Uh what what else we got on the horizon? Uh well, uh you know Dragon Con. Right around the corner. I think the schedule might be out uh, uh, a little bit later tonight if it's not out already. But looks like we are on Saturday again. So everybody clear your schedules uh, mm -hmm. to make sure that you are at uh, our show on Saturday. And I think, Brian, we are in a different hotel. I think we're in the, the Hyatt this year. Oh, my. Interesting. Yeah, yeah we that, don't have an that, official is schedule a, is that quite a, yet. Move up? Is it a move over? What? What? You know. Yeah. Well, it depend on the on the room. Chaos is a ladder. Oh, oh yeah, 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 sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh, here, wait, hold on. Let me let me see where we were on in the in the preliminary schedule. Sure. Yeah the uh, the website is dragonconpodcast dot com, but they uh they've got a very friendly message that says it's uh coming soon. Not quite there yet. 
Uh, okay. okay so. Well, I know everybody's working really hard. If you haven't been, of course, it's a fantastic uh, adventure. Uh, we'll be there at a bunch of events and also quietly playing our favorite game on the planet. Find an abandoned bar. <laughs> ah, yes. Yes. We are the kings of this sport. Uh, a few have challenged us in the, our ability to recede from any attention and find a quiet bar where either one of us talk to each other and we just play Hearthstone <laughs> with an occasional grunt. Oh, and you may say, uh, are you a fan of advanced tactics like showing up at a steak place 10 minutes before they open, walking in like you own the joint, have them say, sorry, sir, we're not open yet, and the two of you casually shrugging and saying, that's all right, we'll wait, as you sit at the bar? <laughs> Ah, witness the pair as they synchronize uh, a clink every five minutes uh, when one of them buys a beer because they're drinking really fast. Uh, yeah, a, a, a true story. If you catch one of us uh, in that moment, turn us upside down and we have to tell you where our gold's at. That's, yeah, uh, that's, that's a true that's story. That is true, actually. Right, here we go. Saturday, 10 p.m. in the Marriott. So we're going to be in the center of the havoc, wow! Uh, a Saturday wow. night Dragon Con at the Marriott. Wow. Holy uh, shit! Yeah, that's really? Awesome. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, gonna yeah, be yeah, insane! That's awesome. Fuck. Yeah. Wait, so we can just run outside. Is that, and, like, is that the big? People. Is that the big room? I think it is. It's it's a uh, uh, big room. Six hundred one and six hundred two. The big room is astonishingly big. Wow. Uh, okay. Yeah. Who's not? Gonna fill it. Guess who's not gonna fill it? Wait, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what. Uh, uh, the secret. Uh, the secret is to make the star of the show uh, don't get brodied or something. Like like we could we could figure out some way to get everybody in. Either that or Jackson Miles. Hey, is there a chance we could see the return of Jackson Miles Young, the all set up might, magician? He might. Well, I, I'll tell you what. Maybe <laughs> maybe Jackson Miles Young, the all set up magician, can can open the show. He was a hit at last Dragon Con. He's Wait, been, he's I, 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 he was great. Yeah. Event. This I I don't know Jackson Miles Young. But oh, oh, sounds, oh you didn't? Oh, no, oh, no, God, no, it's, but it's, it's, it's the it sounds, best bit. Okay, so it sounds so, it sounds the all set up magician sounds like amazing. Uh, uh, number one, I am convinced that it would be standing ovations everywhere if Justin were to take this to magic event. Number two, uh, <laughs> it, it was definitely something that Justin had no confidence in. He yeah. said at best he could stretch it out for maybe three minutes. That was his target. <laughs> okay. and, and, of course, the, the conceit was I, I got halfway through my magic show and stopped and was like, hey – uh, you know what? There's somebody I've not I've not seen this act. Justin saw him. Said it was amazing. Uh, please welcome Jackson Miles Young, the all set up magician. Uh, do we have some highlights here? Oh, yeah. look at this! I heard Q. <laughs> You're barely on know, stage. I love <laughs> says this is the aristocrats but for magicians <laughs> Running out in the audience, he's getting everybody fired up and engaged. I immediately pass right by a child sitting in the middle of the row. <laughs> This was astonishingly good. So, uh, effectively, Brian came up with the brilliant uh, idea that I should just keep talking and keep asking for things and just always end with, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and it, like, it's, just, it's just bigger that, and bigger. That, than, the one awesome. moment of true awesome. uh, brilliance that I think happened was um, after, uh, by the way, record-setting what 13 minutes i think he went 13 minutes uh this on, video is whoop. nine uh okay. it could be it could be yeah something like that uh but uh but uh, but right i i said go until you can feel 
the joke dying. Yeah. The yeah. minute that the joke is dying, say, uh, point out the envelope that's been there the entire time. And then so you're like, that envelope's been there the entire show long. And then me in the audience, I seated, I go, I go, no way. <laughs> and you could feel this wave of like, shut up, shut oh, up, oh, shut really, up, shut really? up, right? Wow, that's and good. so and so he re- gets everybody to recap. So Keto. Here, we, we can just play this is the ending. Uh, the man now has the thing in his uh, in his hand. But but, yeah. but but keep in mind, keep in mind he uh he he, he uh recapped uh, you know the city, the place everyone was come, uh, the, the cards that people thought yeah. thought of, you know, totally free choice, totally free choice. You've been a great audience. Good night. (laughs) (laughs) That might be one of my favorite moments of performance art I've ever witnessed. That's awesome. Yeah, that's amazing. Uh, that was so 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 fun. So yeah, maybe maybe Jackson Miles will uh, uh, come back, come back to Atlanta. That's I think he lives in Atlanta, so I think it's easy for him to make it. <laughs> If uh, but but yeah, all right. So yeah, it looks like uh, uh, six hundred one and six hundred two aren't aren't uh, super gigantic. So we're gonna have a great time in uh, the center of the madness, the eye of the storm. Uh, great, uh, the Marriott on Saturday. It's gonna be great. Uh, that'll be good, man. You want to take a moment and uh, thank the people who make our show possible. Mm, yeah, Brian. Let's go ahead and thank everybody who's a patron over at patreon.com slash night attack. Again, that is patreon.com slash night attack. Just go ahead and kick us a little, just give us a little bit of cheddar if you don't mind. Yeah, man, well, there. man, won't you feel us up? I'm just saying, if you got a little little coin in your pocket, you don't mind splashing it on our faces, then go ahead on over to patreon.com slash night attack. Yeah, man. Uh, meanwhile, <laughs> if we, uh, uh, oh, also, I guess, uh, are we shouting out people who are, uh, who are, uh, live subscribing right now on Twitch? Well, here, I, let's make them two separate things. Let's, let, let's do the name chant corner hour and then we'll do the, uh, uh, uh Twitch horror 30, uh, seconds. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> the Twitch. All right. So that means it is time for ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the Night Attack new Patreon name chant corner hour. It's an hour of it. <laughs> Dude, this person is a huge fan of Captain Morgan, I assume. So much so that he changed right. his name to be oh. a, a name that, that, that Captain Morgan would approve of, and I assume that's why he just edited his pledge from a dollar and one cent per episode to yeah. ten dollars an episode. Wow. This oh my person gets it. Sitting up there in the crow's nest, looking out, and the captain looks up and says, The hell are you doing? CJ Boat. CJ Boat. CJ Boat. CJ Boat. I, I fucked the dog with your name once. <laughs> Its name was Boat Fucker. CJ Boat. 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 Boat. Oh, Captain, Captain, Captain. Do you remember CJ Boat? I remember the boat names. I was uh, uh, by 1993. Oh, well, I named my boat CJ because I was a fan of Baywatch. Okay, but 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 meanwhile, we're talking about the person CJ Boat. Uh, oh, not a boat. No, what you're what you're forgetting is that it, it was a boat that I had in the early 90s. I wound up selling it when Cobain died. <laughs> oh, oh, you 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 couldn't handle the lonely isolation of being alone. Oh no, the... no, I was. A, the captain loves his uh, loves his strumming guitars, and I was just like, no, too soon. <laughs> I gotta sell this fucking boat. <laughs> See, you were disappointed by all the lost genius that we lost. I was, in- I was like, well, no, I swear to God, if Lane Staley goes, I'm selling my other boat named Hasselhoff. <laughs> uh. <laughs> right. But, 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 CJ Boat. Do you remember him working with you? I do. Yeah. Uh, was he good? Uh, he, he was. He was a good man with a good plan. He came. He came from a long line a of boats. Canal Panama. 
he was he was a man, a man with the plan, and and he was there for the tan. <laughs> oh my God! Did not think that that one was on. <laughs> we are we are getting some subscribers on Twitch, and it looks like every time somebody subscribes, you see. Body rocking out or me plucking hairs off of Justin's I swear, back. I thought I reset it so that it would be the Sriracha Facial this week. <laughs> uh, well, I don't know. I guess we have to have a few more resubs to yeah, see if so. it comes in with a Sriracha Facial. <laughs> Uh, hey, no, thank, thank you very everybody. Much. Uh, Mitzula, I see you uh, for, for giving us bits and uh, and everybody who's subbing. Crips and Zamboni resubbing. Trey Warren resubbing. Thank you guys so much. You guys can do that right here on Twitch. If you have Amazon Prime, you have a free sub. That's that free you money. Earn. You can steal that money right out of that big blue rocket that that, that he keeps in his pocket. He says, yeah, I got blue. a pocket rocket. It's blue origin blue is of not the species. A good color for that. <laughs> That's uh, yeah, blue. Mint. It is for my rockets, Bryce. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry, Chip. <laughs> Amazon Jeff Bezos. Bezos. <laughs> Bezos. I used to sell books, and now I sell knockout punches with these guns. Oh. <laughs> Welcome to the gun show. <laughs> I just remembered the bit for Bezos, and it's punching fools in the face with these massive guns. <laughs> So, uh, anyway, thank you to everybody subscribing. Thank you to everybody stealing money right out of Jeff Bezos' fat pockets. And Why on you, scoundrels? I'll be back. <laughs> Get so long, jerk. <laughs> ah! <laughs> hey, Slider5597, thank you so much for subbing earlier in the stream. All right, Bryce, you've had amazing game after amazing game after amazing game. So right. no pressure if this one sucks. That's, why we, that's why we wrote this song. Amazing game, game that Bryce he found game. that saved the show like this. Like this. <laughs> he, the he show was bad, but, but now it's is. good. Thank you, Bryce, for the game. Yep, games, yeah. <laughs> Looked over oh, Jordan and what did I see? <laughs> Bryce had a game for game. Night Attack. Uh, night Attack. <laughs> Play ball! <laughs> Play ball. Well, uh, Play ball. I, I'm, I'm so oh, Night Attack. <laughs> you have so many games. <laughs> <laughs> that would be the second time in four episodes that we did a parody song to the Canadian National Anthem. <laughs> oh, uh, well, I do have some bad news. We don't have a game today because we have to we have to stop the show right now. Oh, we have to go and we have to go to this meeting. Oh, uh, to, to fill everybody in, we we've been all three, all four of us have been yeah. streaming on Twitch for a little while now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, we're blowing the shit up. Yeah, and like any hot personality on the internet we uh yeah. have been offered to pitch games and to oh, sell video games, games to sell video games oh, yeah. right? because yeah, yeah. twitch is a video game site yes we all, yes yes we all know a lot about video games well, and, and we've been burned before we oh, used to do the yeah. show on justin.tv and then they said no if it's not video games get the hell off our network and we had to get, get out off. of here that's right and so, and so we're not not this time fool me once eat shit fool me twice uh, double double you. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, now I, I I know this might be a little sudden to you guys, but don't worry. I'm here to I'm here to help you out with the pitches. We're about to go into the meeting oh, thank now. Goodness. Got, uh, we have a uh, test uh, audience uh, who uh, just okay. showed up. Okay. Joining okay. us have... live in studio, ladies Woo. and gentlemen, is recent uh, uh, juried selectee of the best clay in Texas show. Can, can I say it? Can I say it? Sure. All right. Uh, Bonnie Brushwood joining hey. us live. Hello. Bonnie, uh, Bonnie got two Bonnie. pieces into an art show. And they're amazing. Yes. Yeah, they're oh, really, yeah. really amazing. Thank you. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Uh, well, so I, I, I'm finishing the connection, the ISDN line, to our uh, remote executives that we're oh. going to be pitching some games to. Okay. Now, I know uh, I, I sent you guys these a while ago, so you may not remember exactly. I remember but... all of them. Oh, p perfect. I, I That's mean, you should, why th because th you made these vertical slice demos I, that the player that they're going to play. Super did. Also, what's a vertical slice demo? Exactly. So, uh, for uh, 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 thank you, thank you for calling. Oh, we get, oh, no, guys, thank you, thank you for 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 taking that time, everybody. Uh, we're going to start with Brian here. Brian's got the first pitch for for this game. This is called PN03. You remember PN03 stands for something? Oh yeah, PN03. It, huh. It's uh, that's right. <clears throat> uh, you remember it's, it stars Vanessa Z Schneider. 
of course, a fe- sort of femme fatale and character. This is, uh, I'm is the sorry, there's a lot of Vanessa D. Schneider uh, stuff. That's um, right. No, uh, this is the newest this is the video, video game, game one. This is the video game one for her. Vanessa yeah. D. Schneider, that's right. Oh, man. Uh, this was tic-tac-toe for a new generation. <laughs> And in this case, yeah. uh, you thought that it was just uh, knots and crosses. Uh, no, not anymore. It's 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 punches and boners. Yeah, that, yeah. Uh, the uh, new oh. game. If I can direct the the, in, the executives to their game pad, and, and we've we've got actually a, a remote feed of them uh, uh, trying out the demo here. Uh, but but why don't oh, you walk good. and yeah, guide yeah, them no, through no, this play demo? Play the here. demo. Play the demo. As you all know, see. Okay, <laughs> you join in the game. With a pirouette and right. some sassy style. Very sassy. Right? This new evolution now, now, of tic-tac-toe. what you want to do is, see, room result, each room, you're going to put either a, a boner or a cross. Right. Uh, but while all the while. But you have to fight to get and pick your position. Yeah. Huh? You, you have to avoid these lasers. Give, I mean, that's a lazy the, 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 baby The cross boomer. doesn't necessarily represent Jesus. I just want to make that clear. It's the, like, it, you can right. go where you want. It's a British cross. where they Yeah. Yeah. Uh, or, uh, uh, or, uh, P P N O three is of course uh, a reference to uh, Pinoy, which I exactly. think is a Filipino person. Yeah, that's correct. The okay, Pinoy. good. <laughs> <Phew>. <laughs> you got that. Nailed it. Okay, I'm <laughs> okay. uh, doing great. Uh, doing this fantastic. was a. I'm glad our team put it together. <laughs> this hero, super Filipino. Like uh, exactly. Uh, and I don't mean that that she has a lot of Filipino in her blood. I mean. Her name is Super Filipino. Vanessa Z. Schneider, exactly. <laughs> Very <laughs> cu- <Super>. cultural. <laughs> well, and that's just it. We the didn't want to be hemmed in on anything. Super Filipino. Right. <laughs> so, um, uh, but yeah, I'm Fantastic. really proud about what we put together. Uh, I think this one is valued at uh, $2 million. All right, fantastic. So thank you for your consideration. Now we're, we're going to move on to the next pitch. We read, about, we, read a lot, we read a lot of ideas. Everybody's going to get a chance to <laughs> no, pitch. No, I'm sorry. Yeah, thank you for your time. Yeah. Uh, Mike, thank this you one. your service. Yeah. <laughs> this, uh, Mike, this one goes <laughs> without saying. If, if, if I can If I can direct the executives to the, the phone, the test phone that they've got uh, on, on uh, in front of them, uh, and you guys uh, sort of. Mike, why don't you talk people through this, the, the, the demo of your game here? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just for the and for the audio listeners who can't see, it's a mobile phone game. Yeah, it's, it's with a, featuring Garfield. Okay, yeah, in, no, in no, augmented no. reality. <laughs> yeah, that's that's not that's actually not Garfield. That's that's a trademarked and and like and 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 Garfield mutually ex- like like yeah, it, it's it's. Uh, Barfield. <laughs> it's Barfield. <laughs> exactly. Now, what, uh, what, what is what is the action that the the, the executives are taking right now? And in this so, demo? and so, what you're trying what you're trying to do is you're trying to take a donut, you're trying to get it actually into a receptacle where mm. you can uh, th- basically <laughs> the more the more donuts you get into your receptacle, the yeah. you know there's the, like a food bowl. Well, yeah, Barfield but this, has this a, is like actually. But this holy is, this shit! Is, just time out. Time on everything. This sure. is too much of a Hold mind I, I do have to pause. Are we? Demo. Are I we guess. seeing? Are we seeing a real like Garfield <laughs> ripoff real... of Pokemon Go? Yes. yes. This is the most yes. amazing yes. thing yes. I've ever seen. This is called Garfield Go. Uh, <laughs> obviously, Mike, it sounds like you've got a real big hit on your hands. Brian Brush, yeah. can't stop talking about yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. We 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 actually uh, we actually focus tested the crap out of this one. Uh, yeah. Hey, children, uh, tr- uh, tr- children. True story. Brian Brushwood follows me on Twitter, so I think I can. Does uh, he really? Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The Australian coder. The Australian coder, yes. I love that guy. Oh yeah, he I can help out with, with Garfield Go. That guy's that's amazing. So that's, the Arya, a, uh, augmented reality. All right, well, oh, and they're gonna find the treasure. They're looking. They're playing hot cold with Garfield now in this in this AR augmented reality room. And the, oh, there is the treasure. <laughs> that's a fantastic <laughs> demo. All right. Well, thank you for sharing this 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 demo with us, Mike. This, uh, this Garfield seems much slender and 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 more active than the Garfield I knew. Well, yeah, as he's a been, child. he's been yeah. getting out like the, uh, yeah. the, the you're, he's, you're, you're trotting around. He recently trotting discovered around he's gay. <laughs> and he wants to take care of the merch. Ooh, mm. good for him. Mm. He's uh, taking care of himself. That's a that's a weird. Decision. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a decision, Justin. <laughs> yeah, man. It was born that way. Jesus. Jesus Christ. What, what, what listen, is, I'm what sorry. It's like executives in China. This is not how we normally would talk. Listen, listen. Uh, there's a lot of homophobia on both sides. <laughs> yeah. All right. Now, <laughs> now Justin. Uh, uh, <laughs> God damn it. Oh, too soon. <laughs> 
<laughs> Justin, uh, here, maybe you could uh, help save this, help save the temperature, help save the atmosphere in the room right now. Gotcha. Uh, hey, uh, hey, guys, what's up? Hey, man, uh, super cool. We're having a great time here pitching to you guys. Uh, we're 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 pitch perfect, right? <laughs> okay. Hey. Next uh, next pitch. Yeah. Okay. So, Justin, uh, but before we get into this demo, why don't you tell the people about Crazy Bus? This is your your game. Crazy bus. Yeah, oh, and, and, and I remember Lots people have been saying about crazy bus, like people have been coming up to me and saying, Hey, man, when's crazy bus coming out? Is crazy bus a game or is it a lifestyle? And I'm like, listen, you better get your get your head on your shoulders and your butt in your pants because you're going to lose both when you play crazy bus. <laughs> You lose isn't your head that, and that, your butt. Isn't that actually the slogan? Isn't that the actual sale? Like the 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 get your head and your hey, pants. Man, and the... Crazy bus sounds like a real trip and a half, Mister. <laughs> yeah, it is. All right, so I, I'd like to direct the executives over to, to try out our demo here of, of Crazy Bus. Of course, uh, uh, Ho yeah. in Venezuela. Uh, a lot of our is... a lot of our uh, marketing deals that we have in place. Oh, oh uh, my God! So this is, uh, is crazy this, bus. Is this, this is good. the proverbial bus we were talking about a couple episodes ago? So oh, the bang so, bus. Uh, the good, yeah, that's really what's a, crazy about it. This, as, as you're gonna see here, this does take place in Venezuela, and yes, we are making a political statement about the 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 uh, unlawful uh, uh, overtaking of the government by Maduro. It, it, this game also does take place in 1994. Uh, also, well, per the canon, uh, this used to be the Bang Bus. Uh, yeah, but I this is where it went into true. service afterwards. Now, we got a lot of models of bus here actually, now. I think. Well, so initially, you could pick the Bang Bus. That was an initial thing, but we're going to save that for DLC. So uh, uh, you will eventually be able to play as the Bang Bus. Right now, we just have regular buses, buses for uh, driving, buses for sleeping, a little bus for. Not the bang bus oh, yet. Oh. Almost got you. <laughs> like, now, now talk oh, about this, this fantastic bang. footage that we're seeing of the, yeah, of the okay, bus. Okay, so right now this is our initial screen here where everybody understands that a bus is part of the game. <laughs> what we found in our focus testing was if you called it crazy bus but didn't show a bus rolling across the street in the first loading menu, that the people were confused. They're like, wait a minute, uh, where's this bus? Did OJ kill his wife? All these questions. <laughs> I swear, please. So tell now we've me got this. this is is now I'm showing off the blue bus. This is a fantastic blue bus. This is a real game. Blue bus alley. It's the shittiest Genesis game ever. Saying, uh, hey, uh, uh, why bus. are all. Hey, bl blue buses matter as well. And we're like, <laughs> we don't we agree with you. So here's this level that we put in. <laughs> all right. So that's crazy, bus. Thank you so much for, for that pitch. Yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, uh, we're really big fans. And uh, there's a little someone who wants to say bye, too. Yeah, all right. See you later, guys. Bye. <laughs> now, now, Brian, you you had a you had a fantastic idea. Now, uh, we, we're in a new generation of consoles. We got that the PlayStation Four. Oh, and sure. The Xbox One. You got that Nintendo Switch. You got the Nintendo Switch. And yeah. Every every console generation really needs a character, like a mascot game, right? You oh got... yeah, and and I I'll say it before. I'll say it again. Mm -hmm. uh, make him hateable. Make right. him just horrific. Like just. An abomination yeah. against all of humanity. Yeah, and when you when you think of a mascot, right, it's always and like, also like, yeah. how bad is it? Monkeys, chimpanzees, and humans, ninety eight percent similar DNA. You get to you get to get up in my biz. If I'm ninety eight percent in love, that's uh -huh. mostly in love. Almost all the way yeah. in love. And you can't shut down that love. You can't. No. I know. Twenty years almost. <laughs> 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 so, uh, so in the I vein of, real, I don't know. so you know, you, you, you and when you have a mascot, it's got to be someone you understand just from the name. Right? Oh yeah, you got yeah. Sonic, Somebody, the Hedgehog, which is a hedgehog. He's uh, who's who goes fast. Right. You got Crash Bandicoot, who is a Bandicoot. That's uh, an, an didn't animal. Didn't crash nearly as often as I like, but yeah. You've got a uh, uh, Master Chief, who is sure, a, a. He's a master a, and a chief. A, a, right. Yeah, exactly. A, a, uh, proud Native American. <laughs> So uh, I, I remember this when is, he was a journeyman chief. It was pretty cool. <laughs> it was, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I, 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 you've told me that this was the inspiration for your character, Billy Hatcher. Yeah. I'm Billy. sorry. What what was that name? Uh, again? Billy Hatcher. Uh, I'm sorry. The the microphone is not great. Billy Hatcher. Billy Hatcher. Oh, yeah. Yes. Billy Hatcher. As, yeah. as we all know, mm. he's an assassin. 
Uh, and, of course. And, um, uh, of course. Uh, the job is for the little guys to, you know, shoot the legs and the kneecaps off of all of them. But ultimately, as the villain dies, sobbing in regret, I would like to point out, so he has a chance to go to heaven, sure. Billy Hatcher gives him the hatchet. Yeah, he's the hatcher. He uh, ching chong uh, and then sends them yeah, off yeah, to the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Uh, but uh, now, now that's... That's the, the lore. The that's, that's the, the lore. That's the backstory of Billy Hatcher. Obviously, in our game... Uh, it's a little more general focus. You've got uh, uh, a, a, a young child here who just rolls his, his eggs. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's, that's how he spends his day. That it's egg. like a prequel. Well, okay. You, you know what? Can, can, can we be real? Sure. Can, can we be real? Um, there's actually one of his... One of his... I, I did not mention this before. Um... Billy Hatcher is clinically insane, and this is what's That's going on in his head. You're actually that. watching a mass murder right now. It may look like it's not a real egg. Egg. What is, Wait, is this not a what's what's in real like? Uh, I know spoiler alert, but you can't hide anything from investors. What is the egg actually um, that he's rolling over these animals? It's his dick. It's wow. his dick. Oh, wow. It's, uh, it's a a, this is a remake of Custer's it. Revenge. I forgot to mention. Oh that. my goodness, that's that's. Wait, how did Custer? Did he whip out his dick and beat people? Oh, did, oh hold on, did, time yeah. out, time oh, out, time out. Do you not know about the game Custer's no, Revenge? Oh, oh yeah. no! Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> it's body. Uh, it's pretty explicit, even for an Atari game. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. But so this is his his and I, I can understand because you can see as we're watching this footage that the egg gets bigger as he kills more enemies. Correct, correct. And uh, and and uh, uh, I would like to point out that ours is a significantly legally different song that uh, from Katamari Damacy. This one goes. Bah, he's killing lots of folks. He's totally a murderer. Ah, he's uh, insane in the head, and he's got a twisted boner. I like it. Great. I like it. Fantastic. No, you don't. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, You're jealous of my talent. Yeah, no, You're jealous of my skill. Great. Ever since we formed this corporation, I was waiting for this yeah, day. Yeah, and now is the day you're going to stab me in the back. You've hated this project since day one, Look, Mike man, TV. Because you, because you, guys, you guys. never gave me full support this of my is, Garfield. I, 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 my Garfield yeah. is garbage. Yeah, no. The, the Gar God, Garfield stands for it. garbage. Damn it. Garbage field. Garbage All right, field. Uh, Mike. Mike, uh, you. you How prepped. do you know his full name? <laughs> <laughs> so, Mike, you you prepped just a little bit of a of a cinematic before we get into the pitch for your game, but uh, yeah. uh, we're, we're gonna we're gonna watch it just here, just for really quick. Uh, what's it called again? Oh, we'll get to that. I'm so tired. Oh yeah. So actually, it's it's really funny. We actually we actually did a, ro a lot of rotoscoping with this. We uh, got Andy Circus. <laughs> he's actually he's actually doing all of the animation here. You know, and but it was funny because we told him we're like we want you to really we want you to think digital we want you to be like an like an older thing but we want you know so so it's all rotoscopes so this is actually him performing yeah this but he's doing it in the form of of a kind of like awkwardly animated Right. Yeah. Well, yeah. And, well, and just so everybody knows, it seems like it's a, a young co-ed going to sleep. She is she is so tired and she's laying down to go to sleep. Uh, yeah. Oh, but uh -oh. you would think that she's the main character, but actually it is this titular character, Mr. Mosquito, Yeah, I believe. Uh, who, yeah. yeah. But, uh, That's, I, actually, so, bold decision here. Stage one, you have to suck Reyna's blood yes. and then suck her blood again. Yeah, this yeah. is actually, and it's and and the thing is, he's he's actually that's he's actually a uh, a flea, he's a flying flea. He's, he's not even he's, a mosquito. It's, it, no, yeah, it's it's yeah. the bubonic. He's spreading the bubonic plague. We're trying to keep this kind of timely, you know. So so we're gonna have we're gonna have Incredible. each deal, each DLC is gonna introduce a new. Uh, a, a, yeah, like a new uh, communicable disease that is that is basically propagated Why? by, Why? you know, by the insects. So yeah, so that's, well, that's incredible. Yeah. Now there's a lot of flight controls. It's not easy in this day and age to do. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, actually, this is this is for the Nintendo Wii, and Going you actually back to the you Wii. actually have to flap. Yeah, yeah, you actually have to flap your arms. <laughs> You have to flap your arms to stay aloft. Yeah, and so yeah. so that's now, what, this is, what gesture do you yeah. have to do to do this move that's coming up uh, just in a in a minute here? What, what's the gesture that you would use with the remote to sort of oh. do this this thing? 
that where you penetrate your oh, yeah that one you actually have to use your nose we actually have a prosthetic that you that like with a collapsible prosthetic a nose controller it, yeah yeah nose oh controller yeah 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 and you have to do it with enough force to actually penetrate skin predate like based on your size like based on your libris yeah you know, so yeah it, it takes a little bit of work but that's you know that's the weed it's, it's keeping you healthy yeah not comfortable with your, with your game Mike <laughs> what <laughs> what it's 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 the Garfield you, you attack the Garfield and now and now and now you have an issue with my it's very Strangely sexual for uh, yeah. Insects. Well, yeah. you know, but you we haven't seen the we giant some, battle we did some yet. focus testing, and apparently, the two things that sell well huh. is one, believe it or not, one is sex. The other one's uh, what's a oh, sex. Those two things. Yeah, those yeah. two things. Like we're like, well, these things sell apparently. Interesting. Well. There you go. Thank you so Just much. Just fly right into her cooter. Yeah, it, I think well, it's a relaxed point. I think I think you made a dirty game, Mike. I. No, look, guys. Look, this is it's it's basically the CDC. Uh, oh yeah, you're dead. This is a big like sort of kaiju battle now with this young girl. Uh, Incredible. Well, we're looking forward to the rest of Mr. Mosquito. Yeah. Also, did you indicate that our investors were Japanese? Uh, no, that they were Chinese. <laughs> Chinese. <laughs> Chinese. Oh, yeah, that's okay. where all the money is. Totally. Right oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Certainly. Yeah. Where is that in Japan? <laughs> Point to China. <laughs> All right, uh, now Brian, we're just gonna we're just gonna start the demo for the investors now, uh, and you can just sort of give us a talk to us a little about what's going on. All right, look, I, we put a I, lot I, of I don't get my I don't get mine. Wait, wait, you wait. go next. Somebody said, "Is this insect?" Oh wait, you know what? Sorry, you're right. This is this is your I I totally messed up, Justin. This is your your demo. Yeah. What the hell? All right. Well, uh, uh, listen. Number one, a lot of people wonder uh, are walls dead. In video. <laughs> uh, uh, seek to answer that question in our brand new game. Uh, open the doors. Walls are here. Open the doors. Uh, colon uh, walls are here. Don't, don't take my word for it. Here's the pitch from uh, 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 AM radio legend Rush Limbaugh. <laughs> All right. oh, oh, oh. Hello, Chinese investors. It's me. Uh, this is, uh, my, my, I, when they asked me if we should have a game, I said yes, as long as there was a weird lion going around, and then there were many walls. There's what so the many fuck walls. am I looking at? This, I'm looking at a game board. This Brian, is... I, Brian, I, Brian, I, Brian, I'm Please. glad you asked. I, you know, I just, I think that the the, the, the map there obviously has its own uh, artistic milieu, if you will. And and that, that right now what we're looking at is a lot of icons where you have literal eyes. They put the eye in icons. Right, so we we it's, we skip ahead a little bit in the demo I'm, here. I'm noticing that there's it says LSD. Well, this is the birth canal, as we can all know that we can we can uh, realize yeah, the sanctity yeah. of human life while we play this amazing game. Uh, what we're gonna do is is show that there are walls inside of us as well. But, but, but why, why is it a maze, <laughs> Rush Limbaugh? I mean, life uh, is a Excuse me, uh, Brian, uh, Brian, uh, Brian, uh, what, what was your question? <laughs> I, said, I said, why is it a maze? The birth canal oh, is a maze a... because when you really think about it, isn't that what life is? Makes you think IMO. <laughs> Rush Limbaugh here pitching a game. <laughs> now, this last scene we've got here is kind of a more open airspace. You've got some of these uh, This the is gates. very clearly Japanese, uh, something that everybody's comfortable with, including me, in case you were wondering. <laughs> uh, what we're going to see here is a lot of faces and trees, cherry blossoms, because we want to have this game as sweet as possible. Look at me. I'm kissing it on the lips. <laughs> Now, what is it? The kissing represents. There's, there, there's a little bit of subtext to the kissing that statue Sub there. Subsex, yeah. Sub yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, well, yeah, you know, well, yeah, you know. The, the biggest thing with kissing is it's it's for sweethearts, and and uh, that's what I wanted to bring to this game. Anybody remember walls and kisses? That's right. All right. What is Fantastic. what does Nerdly think about it? Uh, so Snerdly, uh, you know, Snerdly. What, what do you what do you? No, no. No, no, no. <laughs> God, I was, oh. That's 
pitch. I'm Rush Limbaugh, ladies and gentlemen. Thank Dip you so much, <laughs> Rush. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you, Rush. Rush. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, 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 AM legend. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's pretty right. amazing. Hot damn. That, that uh, Rush will occasionally uh, Brian? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, you, yeah. Have, you have three kids. Oh, we're gonna sure. ch- We're going to change gears here a little bit. We was, that was a little more uh, uh, esoteric, a little more uh, uh, just uh, uh, all out there abstract. Oh, yeah, right? yeah. So this is – you've got kids. You know the kid market. Sure. Kids love Hello Kitty. Can you tell us about Hello Kitty Care? Yeah, Hello Kitty Care is the grueling tale of opening a small business in the Lower East Side of Manhattan. Yeah. And yeah. in this, you're going to have to take on uh, people undercutting your prices. You're going to have mm. to deal with, uh, with 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 pizza shops that are uh, and uh, there's protect- pr- protectionist regimes. It's it's gritty. Yeah. It's yeah. hardcore. Uh, I'm sorry, the name again. I it's forgot. Hello, Hello, Hello Kitty, Kitty Care. Care. Yeah, 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 Hello yeah. Kitty Care. Yeah. I mean, if, if, try, I mean, try this, opening. This tracks. This this tracks. This is how uh, the game. Try, try opening a hospital in Obama's America, and I think you'll get a real look. Oh my God. Uh, I mean, Hello Kitty got. Feel like my bit, you thief. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, tell tell the people what. Ha- this is the beginning of the game. Hello Kitty got yeah, fucked up. Uh, uh, somebody kicked the shit out of Hello Kitty. Yeah, they were uh, and, and, and it, oh, she, the, she, the only thing I'm not seeing in that tools is a rape kit. It's uh, oh, it's okay. fucking. She's messed up. She she's got lacerations, dirt, and twigs, and yeah. And how are you gonna solve that with a yo-yo? I don't understand. I that. think that's a loofah. <laughs> oh, a loofah. Okay. Well, yeah. Listen, uh, uh, Brian. Features uh, yo-yo. The this loofah. is what I think, happens. I think it's when it's when your design, right, design right. team kind of runs amok. Investors, yeah. don't judge yeah. me on this. Yeah. This is what happens when you outsource right. to Fiverr. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Look, yeah. I've done v- the best <laughs> I can. Yeah. 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 Fantastic. Well, that's Hello Kitty. I, you know what? It's a it's a it's a mobile game. Those are small and easy. Those are quick pitches. Uh, yeah, well, Mike, yeah. we've got... Um, uh, is this, is uh, wait, this wait, my... Is d- this d- my... D- did, did Bonnie, Bonnie, did you bring a game? Oh, oh, oh yeah, Bonnie. I, I, I think oh, Bonnie wait, no, did. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Come on. Hey, Bonnie, yeah, Bonnie, Bonnie, you fought Bonnie pretty hard, hard for this. I know, this I know it's a little bit early. Projects. I know it's a little bit early, but yeah, so it is. It's, you try it out. It's, you, it's, it's awesome. It's called Space Chem. This is the very first screenshot that we can share of the demo right now of Space Chem. Why don't you tell us about what Space Chem is? Uh, is and keep in mind the investors they're Chinese. Yeah, yeah. So because that's space where the money so is. speak very loudly. Space, yeah. <laughs> space <laughs> Cam or Space Kim? Space Cam. Uh, you're doing Spell great. It. I think it's actually Spell Space it. Cam. It's your game. I think, I think it's I think I think it's the name. I think it's the name, not yeah. the not the uh, All right. Well, so Space Cam I mean, is you, where you can see the screenshot here if you need a little bit of inspiration for what right. this game is. See, what we're, we're seeing is the interworks of the installed camera. It's a space cam <laughs> shot of a secret yeah. camera in the toilet of the space station. Sure. And this is the tank. Can, oh, yeah. This yeah. is the plunger. Zero G poops being, being dropped. It's exactly, well, you know. <laughs> what could be sexier than seeing an astronaut <laughs> shitting in a suit? Well, you now so I, 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 I'm racking my brain pants, and nothing ladies. comes to mind. Right, so now now we have some of the uh, so actual like gameplay. You have to wire it and, and send it through the walls <laughs> because you don't want anybody to know it's there because it takes away from the... Oh, oh you, you need you a have to get, It has to be a hidden it cam. It's a, a hidden, hidden cam. cam. Got it. Uh, that's Got right. it. Well, that's fantastic. Thank you so much for that. that <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, that's yeah, great. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're we're really excited about that one. Like, yeah, that that's you know. Uh, uh, no, that actually happened in a bubble tea place around here. So. Oh, Wait, what? what? Yeah, that was like news. Oh, like the bubble tea. Like, yeah, hold on. Time out on everything. <laughs> somebody, this is the real somebody thing. Somebody actually had somebody a... locally got busted having a, a peekaboo cam oh, for yeah. people pooping. This is why I don't drink boba tea. That's... <laughs> Just weird. Well, that's yeah, to be honest, weird. that's why I mean, I, that's, this is why I don't it? poop. The music yeah. guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I haven't. I haven't pooped since 1986. Was, what? Yeah. Sorry, was what was that, that Justin? Sorry, was that Chubby Jackers who had the shit cam? <laughs> no. Wait, really? Wait, really? Yeah, one of them had, or or was it uh, uh the other one, the other like famous rock and roll, early rock and roll guy oh, who man. had who got Elvis? busted for having a bathroom cam. Uh, oh, no, I, I don't, don't know. know. Like a rock Bing and roll Crosby. Guy, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bing Crosby actually. Yeah. That's, a, that's <laughs> what the bubba bubba. The bubba. He was always Chuck trying Barry, to finish Chuck the word. Chuck Berry. That's who it Chuck was. Barry, oh Chuck God. Berry. Chuck Berry. Yeah. Really? Mm. Yeah. So... It's your cousin Marvin. Now <laughs> yeah. you look at watch people's shit because now I sell camcorders. <laughs> <laughs> watch this. 
my gosh. Click. I think we have a new uh, song medley coming uh-huh. up with the with the poop theme. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Well, uh, uh, who, who's left? Who's left? Uh, um, me. Uh, Mike, Mike, I think this one's for you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah just... Now, when you were telling me about your, your this demo, Paranoia Sco- Escape. Sorry, yes. Paranoia yeah. Escape. Yeah. You described it as uh, an anti-realism world. Par- paranoia Escape. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? Escape. Before is, we yeah. see the demo right. in vivid detail, explain to me what Paranoia Escape is. For the story of this world. Well, yeah, well, I mean, right, so if you get, no details spared, uh, 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 paint a picture with your words, or maybe maybe bust out your uh, uh, guitar and write oh, a song. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, what? Yeah, how I does this would how does how does the theme go I again? Did, I did have it here. Then we, we do like yeah. oh he did he did prepare yeah, this. Thank yeah, goodness, thank goodness. Fantastic. I was you know, worried we, that we, for a second. I, we were texting back and forth like you know we're gonna have a hookup for you. They just they, it really helps if you could play it live versus if you yeah 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 because you you wouldn't want the 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 Chinese. The, yes, the Chinese. Not brown. Yeah. They, they, they they love appreciate. it. Uh, so, uh, hey, per- just just real quick. They I mean, like they, they can't hear us right now. Uh, the oh, Chinese, hold on. The, the Click. Chinese investors. They definitely have money. Oh yeah, yeah. all of the Chinese okay. people have okay. money. I thought so. Click. Yeah. All right. All right, uh, Mike. I think Mike Mike's <laughs> just about ready. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Plug in. Oh, oh. Hey, we got a plug in for you. Okay, you can Wait. go. Pa- paranoia scope. Paranoia scape. 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 So, uh, so this, like uh, like I'm a hockey saying, skate. Um, let, let's hear the song and then we'll see your sizzle reel. I think yeah. I'm. Yeah, I, yeah. So, so, so basically, so basically, you know, like obviously we wrote this specifically for for you investors. Uh, so, Szechuan is nice and Beijing is cool, <laughs> but nothing's better than paranoia skate. Uh, can I? Can we get a little? Yeah, okay. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Keep going. Come on, come on. This is this is. Yeah. yeah. No, I, I, yeah. we want the extended yeah, yeah, mix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tiananmen Square was so long ago. Can we finally just let it go and talk about paranoia skate? Yes, it's paranoia skate. Let's not worry about that one guy that just died. We're not talking about that guy. We're talking about paranoia skate. There you go. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm, so, sorry. I'm sorry. I just got a, a, a direct message. Yes. They said yes. It, they were asking if there's a cut of the main theme that that maybe explains a little bit about how the game plays. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, uh, so the so the game the game. Well, uh, <clears throat> he says. Yeah, in we're, music actually, we're actually we're actually. I just oh, got oh, another, oh, yeah. another another text message. Oh, yes. from, uh, from China that said, uh, uh, "Yeah, you need to sing it." <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, of course. Just a little bit of... So let's, um, yeah, so this is, this, this is the, uh, the game, the game, the game plays. Sure. This game is designed for everybody, so you don't have to play. No, you don't do anything. You just look at the game. It's kind of like a movie. It's basically a movie, <laughs> but it sells for 50 bucks. It's Paranoia Escape. <laughs> so this, this footage that we're watching is, is actually record is, is not interactive footage. Is that correct, Mike? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. So basically what we, what we realize, what we realize is most people are, are get really frustrated playing games. So we decided we would just have that, like we would just, just design the gaming experience, yeah. but they wouldn't have to actually do anything. Everybody wins. Well, that's you know? incredible because yeah. there's clearly a score counter on screen. Yeah, no, yeah, that's because we, we wanted it to be an immersive <laughs> gaming experience. We wanted to create the left. gaming, the feel like you're playing a game, you know, and so the great thing is this works for every, any console. It works, you you can take, you can play with a drum set. Like you can play this game with whatever you, <laughs> I'm, whatever. I'm sorry, did you say this game works on any console? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it any works for anything. Awesome? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. All you have to do is just, you know, watch it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Basically, basically, you can play this with dice. You can play it with dice and tokens. It's that's the great thing about this game. But right? again, this yeah. has no bearing on what you see on the television screen. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's it's basically it's basically a movie. Even though we, you, there are also this sequence of you clearly getting bonus points for various yeah. actions. Yes, well, yeah, well, I believe that's, that's an important that's, plot point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is numerology. Yeah, yeah, this yeah, is yeah, numerology. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's all. That's all oh. part of the story. <laughs> And well, you know, listen, and then uh, Mike, Mike, I don't want, I don't want to tip things because I know that you, you have things set up and and you want to keep some, uh, keep your powder dry. But if we could just skip ahead 
this is like the big uh, uh, pivotal moment of, of of the game. If it has this big musical crescendo, that sure, I think sure, it, sure, it, it does. It, it's it does. a bit of an yeah. epic rock opera, right? Yeah, it's, well, so yeah, this, yeah, yeah, it, yeah. This, this is really where the game comes alive, and and what you're not hearing because we haven't finished it as a master track is is the song that Mike's gonna sing. So yeah, so so this is this is uh, you know so obviously so right now what we've established is that you're a floating skeleton, uh, fighting lots of of angry. A flying fish, but and, ma- mainly and, you're and just feet. watching this happen. Well, yeah, no, well, I mean, no, because no, because no, because no, you you get to decide your level of interactivity. Oh, no, it's like, like Fight know, Club. Yeah, 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 yeah. You decide exactly, your level yeah, yeah, of involvement. Yeah, that's that's exactly it. Got the thing it. Is okay. Like so, so you know, and so you can you could you could play this game with a hatchet and with people's faces. While, like it's it's entirely however you want to. So well, yeah, so let's just so tune this into is, the this soundtrack is, yeah. here. So here we go. So this is so this is this is actually the climax of the game. Like so, right here, this is the this is the critical moment. The big foot where, stomping scene. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, it's it. That's actually your own. You're crushing. It's weird that your the song is just paranoia. you describing what's yeah. happening. Yeah. Don't step on me, stupid feet. <laughs> Cause I got bones made of bones. Oh, don't step on me. Stupid feet, stupid get feet. away from me, get away. stupid feet, what? stupid feet, you know, and so it's basically, that's the whole, and that's, you know, oh, and Jesus then, yeah, Christ. and this then there's Vampire, <laughs> Tina Turner, <laughs> and the stupid feet, there's Tina Turner again, it's Vampire, <laughs> Tina Turner <laughs> and stupid feet. <laughs> yeah, and so that's. Yeah, I, th- I, th- okay. I think that's my favorite yeah, part yeah, of that yeah. is that Bonnie literally couldn't handle seeing it <laughs> and turned away. <laughs> she it. turned away. Oh, oh, vampire Tina <laughs> she Turner. couldn't handle it. Yeah, yeah. we actually, we actually, so uh, awful. we actually have. I a, think that's the game designer. <laughs> She's yeah. she's actually going to be doing she's going to be she's doing a full album based around Paranoia Escape. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's yeah. going to be yeah, it's yeah. going to be it's I mean I mean we kind of we we I'm we a paranoia escaper, paranoid <laughs> for money. You do the escape that you want. Vampire Tina Turner everybody, I love you. <laughs> paranoia Escape. We're out of here. <laughs> well, that's great. Hold All on, right, hold, well, hold on. Can, can we grab Vampire Tina Turner? I know you're very busy. Can, yeah, can we do yeah. a quick interview, Vampire <laughs> Tina Turner? Tina Turner, what's going on? Uh, Vampire Tina Turner, everybody, I love you. I love you. <laughs> Vampire <laughs> Tina Turner, real quick, real quick. How, how uh, did, uh, absolutely, uh, I love you. I love you. I'm Vampire Tina Turner. Uh, 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 Rolling. Uh, Rolling. Rolling. <laughs> Rolling down the river so I can suck some blood. I love you. I'm Vampire Tina Turner. Why Why are you flashing the victory Vs as, as you do that? I love it. What do you I have a question for Vampire Tina Turner? How did you get turned, Vampire Tina Turner? Did someone turn you? Yeah. I remember like it was yesterday, sweet young Bryce. I was sitting on my couch when all of a sudden a vampire came running into my house and I said, I'm Tina Turner. And it said, you better watch out, Tina Turner. I'm going to bite your neck. And he did. Ha, ha, now I'm undead. I live forever. I'm vampire, Tina Turner. I love you. That's incredible. <laughs> well, well, it's, so, so, so I, Mary, keep on burning, 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 burning. burning. And, rolling, rolling, and, and, rolling and, and, into eternity. I'll never die. I'm Vampire <laughs> Tina Turner. At the time, if I remember correctly, you were still married to Ike Turner at the time, right? I was. Ike Turner was a real son of a bee. And I said to him, you better get away from me because there's going to be a movie about our relationship. <laughs> and he said, hey there, Tina, you better not turn into a vampire. <laughs> and I said, too late, motherfucker. And I ate him. <laughs> Ah, uh, Vampire Tina Turner. He feels like Turner. All right. Oh, incredible. Oh, got to do with it, got to do with it. Vampire. What love God. when you're an undead demon? Yeah. Vampire yeah, Tina Turner, thank you for joining us. <laughs> oh, incredible. Oh, yeah, so we got so we got Vampire Tina Turner we on there. Yeah, yeah, attached so she, to. Part yeah, of the no, eat it, amazing. E3. I bet you E3 doesn't have these kind of stars. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. 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 
Uh, well, we're going to end the call here with the investors. Thank you so much. I hope to hear back from you guys very soon about the pitches. Oh, Thank wait, you oh, all of the. We don't. We don't have. Uh, we, we don't. You, have, want a, you want one more? Uh, I. I mean, I would just expect they would give us a response. Oh yeah, 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 yeah! Come on, come on! What do our Chinese investors think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Of our pitches. You can go ahead and unmute, unmute their side, Brian. Sure, oh, yeah. sure. Hold on, let me go. Yeah. Click. We love it, gentlemen. We'll be in touch. Oh great! Oh, All right. Incredible! Oh, oh, damn it. Ah, wait, wait, hold on! Damn it! I also like rice. Man! Yeah. Oh, incredible! Ah, boo. Uh, no, no, no. no. I, I think actually, no. He's he's calling back. He's calling back. <laughs> what, 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 pick it up. What does he have to say? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Click. The... <laughs> go on. Go on. Uh, 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 excuse me, a Chinese investor. Uh, we, we can't hear you. Uh, oh, hello. Can you hear me now? <laughs> yes. 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 yes, yes we can hear there. you now. <laughs> I enjoy our large manufacturing industry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how do you feel about your one child policy? Yeah. It's complicated. <laughs> but mm, generally uh, accepted. <laughs> what, what, what about uh what about gutter oil? Is that a thing? Uh we do have oil in the gutters. Yeah. Um, I mean, right, you don't get it defensive about it, Chinese investor. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sorry. It's it's part of our work. <laughs> So, oh, so as one does, you guys started talking about Tina Turner, and I was like, man, didn't you have, like, a baby late? I was, like, checking it out. Anyway, she said, Tina Turner, headline says, Tina Turner at 73 marries 57-year-old to toy boy Edwin Bach in Switzerland. Good wow. girl. Yeah, right? Well okay. And, uh, uh, yeah, uh, Oprah attended her wedding. Mm. <laughs> mm. Fantastic. There's, well, I mean, oh, she's gossip. undead now, so <laughs> yeah, she yeah. Looks forever. Why she looks undead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Still she's, looks uh... great. <laughs> Uh, all right. Well, uh, uh, thank you. I, uh, I hope we'll have more news about these games coming soon to a console. <laughs> yeah. For, all right. All right. Can we, can so, we feel back? So Reddit, wait, wait, hold, Reddit, hold on. Hold sure. on. Hold on. I, 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 I okay. want to go see the curtain a little bit here all and right. find out. Um, oh, oh, yeah. Do you have all any questions were, about any of these? Were real games? Uh, yes. Absolutely. Uh, we can no, put, that, that you actually wait, even could Garfield, buy and play? even the Garfield one. Absolutely, Garfield. Yeah, the Garfield. So, the, but but the the fuck the last one, the, the so, Stompy Feet one, the Vampire yeah. Tina Turner was an actual game. That's a real that was a real PlayStation game. Uh, the first game, PN03, was a GameCube game from Capcom. Garfield Go is a real game that is GPS based, and you throw lasagna. Uh, uh, Crazy Bus is a very real, uh, <laughs> notorious uh, game. It's awful. It's uh, a bad game. Billy Hatcher is a very real game about it. Uh, B B Billy Hatcher is, I, I did call it correct that it's a straight up Katamari Damacy ripoff, right? Uh, no, this is more Not of like really. a, a character action platformer sort of game. Uh, Katamari. Uh, he's not. He's he's, not he's attacking enemies and stuff here. He's not collecting anybody. Right. He's hatching. But but, but his eggs. egg is getting bigger. The more shitty reeks have a come. But on. eventually they hatch. He oh. gets a lot of eggs. He gets oh. a lot of eggs. Uh, Mr. Mosquito is very real. You go and you uh, suck blood off of this young woman to stay warm for the winter. Oh my God! And they're definitely showing her in the bathtub. Uh yeah. Uh, uh dim, yes. dim dim dim. Uh, <laughs> uh, the the blood walking bags. around game was LSD Dream Emulator. Uh, this is a game based off of a dream journal. And so you go and around these worlds, and you touch walls, and go to these different worlds, and that's the game. Uh, Hello Kitty Care is a very real Flash game. Uh, uh, Space Chem is a very cool and notoriously difficult. Hello Kitty difficult. gets fucked up in that game. Really I wish I wish up. you could oh, realize just how yeah, unfunny it was the, to see her that I know, abused. It's kinda sad. All, 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 all the real violence is off camera. The pussies. Uh, you know, uh, you know, I mean, sure. I mean, if you're gonna if you're gonna address the issue, you might as well kind of show exactly how it happened. You might right? as well like, you know, just yeah. you know really go for it and yeah. just have uh, yeah. uh, uh, Hello Kitty getting treated like uh, what's your button the accused? Oh jeez. Uh, <laughs> what's your button the accused? You know, uh, <coughs> Josie's or Callie, the four year old's favorite uh, game right now. The is, accused is. Daddy video Spa game Day. Daddy Spa oh, that's, Day. Yeah. There's all right. So there's what there's is, a game. So there's. Oh uh, no. Yeah. Okay. All right. No, go no, on. No. 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 no, 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 no. You, no let's talk about that. Like, you guys talk about that, and then I'll talk about because mine's mine's much more twisted. But like, <laughs> but there's somebody you on know Twitch. That's, just, so, yeah, just, so, yeah, right. yeah, so, I yeah. want to know what just happened when she said. My four-year-old's favorite game is Daddy Spa Day, and you're like, that I'm like, reminds I'm like, I'm like, me of no, this story. I was like, I was like, oh, I know that game, but no, the game I'm thinking of is is very, very different. Go so, on. So it's called Daddy 
date or daddy dating daddy or something. Daddy dating oh, sim, yeah. Dream, yeah. dream daddy, a dream, dad. Dream, dream daddy dating. dating. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so, so we, I, I. Hold on. So, so I, I've not seen this. Mm -hmm. I know that we almost did a parody video of it for domain.com, but it was right. too close to the dating sim to thing we had already done ad before. We'd already done, yeah. Right. Uh, so, Dream Daddy is a real game and it's pretty well written uh, for what it yeah, is. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, it's funny, and and okay. the right, yeah, yeah. the Game Grumps made it. Uh, oh yeah, which is okay, okay. So so it's got cool. this this like ironic detached. Uh, yeah, I, I, to actually, it. like as a piece of of uh, interactive fiction about uh, uh, queer adjacent topics of of you are a dad who is going on dates with other dads. Uh, it's it's a pretty good handling of that because that oh, could be huh. very uh, <laughs> uh, tricky to navigate. If it was not handled very well, sure. I think sure. I think it's pretty good about cool. that stuff. Oh so. no, no, no! It definitely kind of skates through a minefield and does it with with uh, a, a plum. Uh, from from what I saw, yeah, it's very. It's not. It's it's heavy. It's it's more on the daddy and less on the dating. I'll put it, I'll put it that way. Okay. All right. huh. and they yeah. they avoid a lot or, of it by making not like, a, none of it sexual. Yeah. Essentially. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. It's pretty neat. Right, but right. like when you make some decisions that really tickle the pickles of of the men that you fancy, That's... like little emojis, kind of uh, uh, emoji eggplant egg... emojis and sweat emojis <laughs> pop out of their character portrait when you do the right choice. Oh, Got what? it. And it's like, very yeah, it's very cool. wacky. Eggplant. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. Brian, Brian, Brian. Sorry. Was that the I sound of know? regret for enthusiasm <laughs> that I just heard? Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just realized that could be the start of an uh, explanation. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, but yeah, those are all real games. Thank you guys for, for playing along and pitching. Uh, Dude, uh, if, if I may get a get a plug in real quick here at the end of this segment here, uh, especially because it's coming up to be con season. We haven't had t-shirts in a while. Uh, we have a t-shirt sort of a solution for people. Uh, instead of us going and printing t-shirts and, and buying t-shirts and holding on to t-shirts, you can now just buy a t-shirt on the internet. Uh, oh, shit. Made some... my, my hoodie my hoodie shipped today. Oh, very hey, cool. Right on. So if you go to bit.ly slash NA shirt, we've got three designs. We've got women's styles, uh, pullover hoodies, and now we have zip-up hoodies, which we did not initially have. I got, I got, my, I got me a zip-up hoodie. Yeah. Um, oh, damn. Uh, uh, get it now. You don't have to go to a con to get these. You don't have to uh, hope that we have the right size. You can just go and get it. Uh, Teespring, Teespring does a weird thing where it, it may say, oh, there's only two days left. It's gonna be up forever. It's right. like a Kickstarter, so it always yeah, that's just that's just you for out. you to feel bad about yourself. Yeah, basically. Yeah. Hey, uh, uh, so, as yeah. long as we're talking about T-shirts, we should point out that we're doing something on the uh, the Modern Rogue Patreon, where uh, oh, yeah. one per quarter we're making exclusive shirts for thirty dollar backers. So if you want to get a badass shirt and mm -hmm. it's one of a kind and you, nobody else will have it, and it'll say the Modern Rogue. And wait, and wait, the thing that we've talked about is that. Them. What's up? Hmm? What do you mean by one of the kind if you're printing a bunch Well, I mean, of we're, we're, well, there's, there's a um, limited run uh, okay. for, on yeah. each, right. each iteration's Wait, limited as run. As of right? right now, the only people who are guaranteed to get that edition of the shirt are, are the $30 a month subscribers, and it's going to be super exclusive. We may are make you... an alternative iteration of it available right. to somebody else, but I, I, I don't know. Part of me wants to just keep it super exclusive. And, we, and we've talked yeah. about that uh, because it's once a quarter, you don't necessarily need to be pledged for the whole quarter. Right. You right. Just you, you can swoop in for the last for the last, uh, the last uh, month. month or so yeah. and, and get it. Uh, but yeah, that's patreon.com slash modern rogue. If you want to get one of the Diamond Club shirts, bit.ly slash NA shirt, all lowercase. Yeah. Oh. Hey, I'll tell you what. What do we shout out, folks, over at Diamond Time? Yeah, yeah man. Head on over to diamondclub.reddit.com. Take a look at that top sticky post there, and you'll see the Diamond Time experience in which we shout out your projects right here in our beautiful... Mm, be beautiful show. <laughs> segment Sorry. of the show. Sorry, I, I, was, I was thinking of that great moment on um, the uh, 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 big, sexy Valentine's Day special when... <laughs> When he says, uh, Michael Bolton, get up, get your beautiful black ass up here. And you go, feel your ball swing back and forth, Michael Bolton. Yeah. That was I funny. can smell was your funny pheromones <laughs> coming out your pee-pee hole. Uh, anyway, right. Dragon hey, Con. Uh uh, uh, open Bayou starts us off. Dragon Con is two weeks away, and it's another chance for the Diamond Clubbers to hang out together as a group. If you are planning on attending Dragon Con, please let us know by filling out the doc at bit.ly slash 285 Fruit Loop, all lowercase. That is bit.ly uh, 285 Fruit Loop, all lowercase. 
Uh, if you need a ride to Atlanta and or a room, go to bit.ly slash DC two DC. That is lowercase DC number two, lowercase DC, uh, or uh, DC to uh, DC. If you've already filled out the doc, please go back and let us know if you have ruined them. And some members have asked for the famous. Uh, some member has some members have asked for the famous wine. And if you want to do extracurricular activities during the weekend outside of Dragon Con, as of now, it's a toss up between the Georgia Aquarium or touring CNN. But anything can change. So let us know again. Bit.ly slash lowercase dc number two dc. Head on over there now. Uh, Scotty Moe says, greetings, Diamond family. It's your friendly neighborhood, Scotty Moe here with a question. Do you like D&D? Do you like books about D&D? Do you love audiobook podcasts about books about D&D? Well, now that I've effectively whittled the demographic down to about five people, do I have news for you? I recently started an audiobook podcast for my novels, Quetzalcore and Quetzalcore Risen. Uh, every week we put out five chapters from the audiobook, and after said chapters, I discuss the creative process of making the books and give some unwarranted writing advice. Eventually, I'm hoping to grow the podcast to other writers and guests, perhaps Mr. Andrew Maine, and to begin doing D&D campaigns with uh, my friends, like the one that inspired the books. But that growth can't happen without you. These first few weeks are important, so when growing a podcast, I'd love for you guys to listen over at bit.ly sets. Slash Quetzalcast. That's Q U E Z A L C A S T. If you'd like to write, rate, uh, <clears throat> rate, write, <clears throat> go to iTunes. It'd be greatly appreciated. Love y'all madly. See you at Dragon Con. Boom. And of course, we have MB Sargent. Hey, Diamond Club. Matthew Sargent here, the artist behind Jury's Meme Squad stickers at stickers or DIAF.com. Do you like DD? Do you like coloring books? How about a coloring book full of D&D characters? Well, I made just such a thing. It's called Wyverns and Watchtowers, Book of Coloring Plus One, and it's available on Amazon right now. You can find it at tiny, uh, tiny URL slash uh, capital W-Y-V, capital W-A-T-C-H. So tinyurl.com slash watch with uh, the W's in both up. What do you got going on, Mike? Uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> that was it was a little bit more strained uh, than yeah, I was yeah, hoping yeah. to no, hear. No, no, no. no. I, I mean, I've got, I've got, a, I've got so much shit going on. It's crazy. I'm, I'm streaming all the time. I'm just basically like, I'm going straight from this. I'm gonna turn on. I'm gonna climb in bed. I'm gonna turn on Twitch, and I'm just gonna let it stream. I, I'm. It's called Sleepy Time with Mike TV. Wait for real? No, no. <laughs> that's, that's brilliant. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. I'll bet there are people yeah. who pay money yeah, for that. Yeah, that's yeah, amazing. Yeah. Sleepy Time with me. No, um, yeah, man. But uh, I, I'm I'm working on a new record. It's got 45 songs on it. It's, it's not like, nearly enough. I know, Everybody I knows know, records. I know. have to be six. Well, you know, it's 60 it's, songs long. It's funny. I, I I was realizing that there's a there's a so much more economy. If I can just take five or six records and smash them all into one, I only pay the one release fee. Like like like. So I'm like I'm like fuck. I'm, I should just always do like 50 song albums. I wait a couple of years and then take my entire output and just put it out and and it saves me money and it gives everybody anyway but yeah so that's what i'm doing right now i'm, I'm putting on a ridiculous uh, and when 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 can people expect that um uh it's it, it'll probably unless we'll see i, I i'm uh it's gonna be happening within the next month or so um i'm 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 not 100 certain on how much promotion i want to usually I, what i do is i just dump a record and then i start promoting it i, I might do a little bit of pre-promotion before little promo yeah, so. huh? yeah, yeah 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 we'll see you know we'll see but yeah, yeah. awesome but uh, uh, so yeah. everybody yeah twitch.tv slash uh mike tv right yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah oh yeah mike tv live Mike TV Live, yeah. And uh Mike TV Live and then uh, of course Get Set Go everywhere you can find music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we're all over the place. Don't worry, <laughs> don't worry, I'll find you. You guys don't even need to do shit. I, I will I will be in your faces in like six yeah, seconds. No, so. I know, but this yeah. is the just just let us let us surgically get through the plug and then yeah, we can Yeah, then amen. We, then we amen. Go. It's fine. Everybody everybody wants to support you. You are always such a great friend on the show. Hey, we uh we don't we don't have a movie draft minute, do we? Uh, oh no! This is last week. Yeah. Okay. okay. Right. Don't. Yeah, 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 I, I yeah, wonder yeah. why. So, yeah. so we're we're just about to get uh, into the home stretch. But um, if you didn't, if you've missed it, DTNS is still in a commanding lead. Night Attack yeah. is still a uh, pretty solid lead, number two. Oh, so, but we did have a changeover last week. We we reported last week that there was one winner in the chat round league. But right now, it's neck and neck. There's a tie. 
with Ballerina, Ballerina Bess, Bess and Roy, and Roy D77. D77. Yeah, but Ahester's only three million behind, but I don't think he's going to do it because uh, they both have all three of them have Girls Trip. By but the way, the winners also have Atomic Blonde. Justin, do what you know what the number one buy of the entire draft was? Uh, I don't know. Did it let the world know that you can't get an infection in your booty hole? Maybe. Because it's your be- booty hole. Yeah, it's your it? beauty hole. Yeah, oh, awesome. Yeah. Your beauty awesome. hole. Uh, <laughs> wait a minute. Did that, did that make $100 million? Girls Trip? Uh, Girls Trip uh, has so far made $97.8 million. Ooh, yeah, it it's will. It. It's yeah. going to be a $100 wow, million dollar buy for that's seven crazy. bucks. Wow. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Dude, I knew the power of the booty hole as soon as I saw that trailer. <laughs> I'm like, this, this is... A siren song for the for America's laughter. That lady talking about a booty hole. That is money. That's a main event anywhere in the world. Well, you know, it's it's because it's true. You know, it's it's a thing that we all suspected, but now it's a lot of people wonder. You about can't that. get an infection it's, in your booty it's hole. It's not true. You, you can't can get infected. No, yeah. no, you can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, dude. Apparently, yeah, yeah, yeah. according to the Ke- to Ke- the Kevin Smith world of movies, like, had an abscess on his butthole. Huh? Yeah, yeah, because not in his booty hole. Yeah, in no. the booty hole. On, on the yeah, booty yeah, hole. Yeah, no. Like his booty hole rejected his body and it folded No, let I mean, come out. on. That's know it. some science. The science on this is settled. Yeah. Uh, the time for yeah. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Justin. Are, are we giving the authority to a uh, uh, comedy? To movies, uh, uh, where, hey, where else do you get your in information, movies. dude? Movies I, are not allowed to lie. I, yeah, where? Yeah. Ask Al Gore. Good point. Good point. Good point. Uh, hey man, uh, uh, Mike, you, you want to take us hole. out with the song or two? Yeah, what, yeah. What, what do you got for us? Yeah. Uh, well, uh, oh, oh, well oh, you mean like like an actual like a song? song? Man, wait. Like, like you you yeah, look look look. Uh, we're clearing the the dance floor. Uh, uh, for those of you guys who don't gonna, know, I was gonna close out with that with the with with that lullaby. Yeah I, can, yeah, I can do that. Do you, you do you do you? Hey, wait, wait, hold on. Yeah, let's, oh, let's sing about sing oh, about booty holes. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, I don't know. Hey, chat realm, would you like to hear a Mike TV song right now? Uh, did, did I hear right? Because uh, Ashley always has Mike TV songs going on during her stream, and uh, uh, did did you do a uh, a cover of the Chain, the 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 Fleetwood Mac song? <laughs> no, no, but. Uh, I might have ripped them we'll, off. <laughs> I might have accidentally ripped them off. Like, like I, did uh, I mention? Yeah, there's yeah. 45 songs on my yeah, latest yeah, album. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, might have had a couple of beers it's, before it's, some yeah, of them. It's, it's, it's snap the strand. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. It's funny. It's funny because because every now and again I'll hear a song and I'll be like, I'm like, I've no, I don't think I've ever heard this song, but that is my melody and those <laughs> lyrics are pretty similar to the lyrics I wrote. So, yeah, 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 yeah. Apparently, there's only like nine songs in the, uh, you know. Yeah, in all in all of rock music. Well, here's the yeah. uh, my, my favorite song that Ashley plays uh, uh, before she starts a stream is, and I don't think you've ever played here on the podcast, is uh, "Stone of Suffering." Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. In fact, yeah. That's that. Yeah. That's. Um... Yeah, man, I can play that tune for you. Man, you I sound mean, like you're pitching a game to a bunch of Chinese investors. And, yeah, yeah. Well, that's it's it's funny because that yeah that's that song. Um, that song was the beginning of my relationship with the girl M that, uh, that, uh, and it's funny because the thing is like, so th- it was, it was this awesome relationship and it fell apart spectacularly, like, like in a wild, crazy. And then Grey's Anatomy was like, Hey, we like this song. And I'm like, Oh great. It's because it's like, it's like my heart. It's I'm bleeding. And Oh, and then I'm like, yeah. okay, yeah, there you go. That's let's that, just, let's that was just the first this, time you, you opened yeah. a vein. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. I'm like, and I'm like, somebody said, go. Hey, that's yeah. worth something. Yeah, you want yeah, money? Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, I'm like, all right, great. This is perfect. So yeah. But, um, but yeah, it's, it's a, so it's funny. This song was written. So, uh, Eric, Eric, uh, our viola player, and he's, you know, obviously he's been on, on the NSFW yeah. show. And so, Eric was like he was charting out all of the all of the the chords in every single key, right? So he's like, "Hey, if you're going to be playing in the key of C, you might as well know all the chords that work in the key of C." This is this is uh, this is the first time I'm like, "Oh wait, there are chords that work in a key? That's crazy! I didn't know." Um, and he's like, he's like, "I'll give you B flat minor. No one ever writes in B flat minor, but I'll just give it to you." And so by the time he was done writing the rest of them out, I had written this song wow. in B flat minor. So. Oh, that's great. I don't want to fall in love. I don't think I'm tough enough to endure the slings and arrows. But I want to be with you, so tell me what am I to do? 
as my options oh they narrow oh the words that you write they are keeping me alive as I pace my prison cell you say everyone is flawed but I know that this is wrong cause there's beauty just as well can't we mine some joy from the stone of suffering? Oh, I'm thinking on you. That's getting me through. I'm thinking on you. And there's a little viola part that goes. I don't wanna fall in love Cause I think I've had enough Of the heartache and the sorrow But I wanna be with you And share in all the things you do And share in all of your tomorrows To the quick, yeah, you strike me like a blade. All the things that you say, cause I see in me some you, so I want to pick you up and carry you away. Can't we mine some joy from the stone of suffering? Oh. There's a little instrumental breakdown that goes. I don't want to fall in love I don't think I'm tough enough To endure the slings and arrows But I want to be with you So tell me what am I to do As my options are oh, they narrow Woo! Yeah. My TV! Yeah, thanks guys, now yeah! I listen to a lot of songs in my <laughs> <laughs> that means a lot coming from you, Vampire Tina Turner. I had a lot of respect for you pre-vampire days, but now as a vampire, let me just say. Listen, that uh, uh, I have said uh, before, and I will say again, that is a perfect pop rock song. That is just that is just great. And, awesome. and uh, thank you, man. Uh, I think you should be really proud of it because it's, it's, it's a fantastic song. Right on. Thank you. Thank you. That's that's yeah, that's uh, awesome. But enough uh, blowing each other. Brian, it's about time for us to stop blowing each other and end the show. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, wow. Time passed fast. Uh, I want to give a huge thanks to Bryce Castillo for helping to put together that game. Anyone sure. in chat realm? We got to we got to thank. Uh, uh, thank you to everybody who submitted links for that. That uh, gave me a lot of uh, uh, help with with getting those in. But uh, uh, no one in particular. Thank you, everybody. Uh, let me apologize in advance if I'm oh. dead one week from now, lost in the uh, the, 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 the forests <laughs> of Nebraska. Um, are, there, are there forests in Nebraska? Are there a lot they, of they, they, for, be, right? There's corpse forests. Oh, you don't wow. want to know about them. Yeah. 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 Heavy duty. It's uh, where I live now! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> By the way, Paul Freeland, if you're listening, please reach out to me. I, I, I would love to see you there. All right, this is so. I'm not even going to allow you to do this to, to just awkwardly reach out via the show. <laughs> yeah, he's your friend. You can send him an email. Uh, yes, I can. But also, uh, I, I don't want everyone else knowing that I email people because then they'll expect me to email them. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't do email. Talk I got. Look, so. you break that seal. You break that seal. You're fucked. Everybody thinks that you just email back to them. I don't know and he's like, no, <laughs> they have to understand. Nobody gets email. Nobody no. gets email. Not <laughs> even you, Paul Freeland. But Brian, seriously, I'm going to email you as soon as the show's over. <laughs> Brian's relationship with Gmail is every Saturday, click open Gmail, type search Cogswell. <laughs> if there's a fresh <laughs> result, click it. Uh, reply. Hilarious. Amazing. You're the best. Send. And we're done with email for the week. <laughs> that is... <laughs> It's a little bit accurate. on the news. Incredibly <laughs> accurate. <laughs> Not okay with that. <laughs> All right, Brian. Uh, what do we learn this week? Uh, dude, we learned that uh, that having more people in the studio is a lot of fun, and Mike TV is incredibly talented. Oh, uh, yeah, we learned that Tina Turner is a vampire now. <laughs> yeah, we learned that uh, to the surprise of exactly nobody, Stephen Cogswell is amazing. Oh, wait. Most importantly, we learned that Bryce is not above stopping the lullaby midstream so that we can get it live. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, Assuming. All right, all right, learned. real quick, place your bets. Place your bets. Does Mike remember all the lyrics to the lullaby? <laughs> Always an adventure. Always a little bit of an adventure. Yeah, yeah, the... yeah. That's, you know, it is. It's. I have expect him to, like, improv a new song, like, Brian's a real asshole, putting me on the spot. Ryan's a real asshole for putting me on the spot. Fuck that guy in the ass. Seriously, this guy's a real big jerk. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was, yeah. I was getting excited. Yeah, I was yeah, buckled yeah, in. Yeah, that's, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's, I, 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 uh, I can't work blue, man. <laughs> You're above it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, guys. It's about the music. It's about the music. Keep it real. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh right. no, night attack is through Is it something that I did? Is it something I can do? Oh no, night attack is done My heart has been broken The depression's just begun Brian Brushwood, every time you leave I wanna hurt myself By pissing off some bees I'm allergic to bees Oh, Justin Robert Young, every time you go, I get so sad that I want to drink a warm glass of Drano. All right, everybody. Night attack. 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 I love you. Ahoy. <laughs> Diamond Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs>